we're going on the Milano Central having some coffee. Espresso. Today, how are you doing? So this is our room. We need to start over here. We have our little coffee station, refrigerator and safe. A little sitting thing with a light under it or TV. And this is our sitting area here. Our bed. Uh, this is the mirror. This is our bathroom. Everything is just like very, it's just glass. This sink is really cool. It's just one single piece of like very thick glass that kind of scoops down into the sink. And then this mirror that has um, like this light to do makeup. This is our bathtub. We have a bidet. All in all, we're very happy with our room. Are you happy with your room, guy? It's night time, so we're just gonna get some rest and we'll start our adventures tomorrow. Today is the 30th, Friday the 30th of September. We arrived in Milan last night and um, we just came in, we went, came to our hotel and ordered some food, some room service, ate and basically just went to bed. And we were very tired because the journey, like the train ride was like seven hours. And so we just went to the gym, did like a quick workout. I say quick, but we were there like an hour. And um, now we're coming back to the room. We're gonna get ready and just walk around and explore. It's 14 degrees outside. It's been drizzling on and off. My impression of Milan is it looks very like an old town. Like it just looks like a bunch of like old buildings and people just kind of patch them together over the years, like just repair it over the years. But I'm sure that's why it's so full of um, history and all that sort of stuff. The streets have like cable cars and it just looks like a very old town, like a very old historic town. With those with skyscrapers scattered here and there, but anyways, we're gonna go get ready and head out. We're gonna get lunch. I'll catch up with you guys later. If you know what ting it is, it tastes exactly like ting. This is also really good. That is the thing. Was it good, baby? Delicious. <laughs> And it was built in, I think they started building it in 1360 to 13 to 1499. 
So this is from the 14th century. I think we can learn a thing or two from how they used to build things back in the day. Because this is still standing and it's in great condition. Yeah, nowadays you build a house and it can't even withstand a little wind and rain. <laughs> yeah. Like I think we have a thing or two to learn from this in terms of building. It seems like bricks is the way to go <laughs> because everything that's still standing is bricks. Yeah. Okay, so here it is. The Castle of Milan. And it has this cool thing right there. Good morning everybody. This morning we're headed to the train station. Um, we're going to Santa Margarita Ligore and then we're going to Portofino as well. Um, guy, come and say good morning to the video. Buongiorno. Tutto bene. It's like 12 degrees. Uh, not what I expected when I was planning on going to Portofino, but I mean, the city is very beautiful. A lot of beautiful buildings especially now that it's like sunrise it's very very lovely to look at 